Audrey, I have a fucking awful hangover. Listen, I have a statement here from the captains of Cork Industry. If you just give it the once over before we fax it on to Simon Coveney. So here we go. Uh, the captains of Cork Industry has just learned the government wants us to spend Christmas with our families. This is a fucking disgrace. Sorry about the language there, Audrey. We're kind of well oiled when we wrote it. But look, it's, it's on the official headed notepaper. So uh, it's official. You know, Simon can't ignore it. It's bad enough that we've been locked in our beloved city for months with a pack of norries and wannabes from the South Douglas Road who bought a BMW with 0% finance because they wanted to impress their mothers. And worse again, it worked. South Douglas Road, Jesus, like how low can you go? Anyway, after months of lockdown, the government is now insisting that we spend Christmas with our families. Sorry, but it's not like we're from Toker, where you know, if you say to someone, you know, we'll just be yourselves for Christmas, they go, ah, oh, Jesus, no, I can never that to me, ma'am. Uh, you see, loving your family, as pure working class, we can't stand our siblings, our mothers and fathers down here on the Black Rock Road. If I never see my brother locked in again, it'll be too soon. After the Christmas card he sent to me last year, addressed to a ridgy 4.5 min in your mansion, Black Rock Road, North Man. Prick. As for my mother, not ma'am, the last thing I want to do is spend Christmas Day uh, in our 7.6 year mansion on the Black Rock Road, uh, squeezed into the corner of her giant drawing room, getting third degree burns from the towering inferno in her elaborate fireplace. Uh, why do Irish families try to cook each other alive over an open fire on Christmas Day? Like, what's the story there, guys? No, I'd be going for a repeat of last year when my mother was due to come to our house for Christmas Day. I called over to her on Christmas Eve and said, you know, Mum, what you deserve is proper pampering, private jet, seven star resort, 10 days on Martinique, just yourself. He said, oh, Reggie, love, that sounds amazing. When am I going? I said, in about 15 minutes. So, you know, start packing. She was gone as well for a New Year's Day fucking double pull. Brilliant. Anyway, and this is it. We hereby call on the government to keep us at level five until January 2nd, because in fairness, I think we've suffered enough. In addition, if you could get the norries off the marina, it'd be like Christmas came early. Signed, blah blah And then Ducky wrote something about me and Martin. Look, we, we'll take that out before we send it. Because, um, yeah, no, that's it. Listen, get back to me as soon as you can, though, because I can't wait just to pour a glass of champagne and go, seasons. That's the way we do it on the Black Rock Road.